Hi guys, welcome to my crazy life. It's Lori and I have a haul for you today. And I have a cup of cheer. My face is starting to do the red thing. Sorry, it's from the skin stuff I'm doing. It'll be back to normal soon. So I have a company that reached out to me. I'm sure you've seen some of the hauls. It's Timu, Temu. I'm gonna say Timu, cause that's how it looks to me. And they sent me some items. Again, they were sent to me, but the opinions are my own. I have some prices written down and I wanted to go over some items with you that I ordered on this haul. This is so exciting. Um, what it is, it's a company, it's an online brand that you order from their website and they ship it to you. Lots of different things and um, yeah, pretty easy. I think I have a coupon code potentially, but there definitely is a link below to all the items that I've ordered in this haul. I am going to open stuff, so sorry for the crinkling. Um, this is some kitchen sponges, and it was $1.19 for a pack of five. Um, and just your regular, you know, sponge, but it has the scratchy on the back and on the front. And I thought, well, I needed some of these. And you get a five pack for $1.19. Like, that's cheaper than a dollar free. I know. And they come in different colors. So I ordered that. This is... um little stuff so let me i'm gonna get everything comes in these bags which by the way the bags alone i'm keeping because these will be great in my luggage there's a hole in them so that you can press the air you know it doesn't hold all the air but this would be great for luggage packing they're really thick plastic bags so i'm keeping those um, I did get this file folder. It is 30 pages and they're like page protectors. So if you have something with patterns, I think would be great to hold my cross stitch patterns, knitting patterns, any of that. It's got your plastic um, cover. The end, I'm trying to fold it. It's an A4 size, which I'm not exactly sure what that is, but you got to fold that and then you get a your end and it would hold all your things and you could file them and put what's in it a4 I don't know if that's eight and a half by 11 it looks a little longer than that but it definitely will hold an eight and a half by 11 I think you'll just have some headway at the top and this was I have to go through my list I probably should have put it in order $4.49. Also, it has um, your class here to hold everything together. I thought that was fantastic, and I do have a lot of patterns, so there's that. Um, I got this for my kitchen sink for the side that doesn't have the disposal that things seem to fall down through. And it's just a mesh sink it's a stopper but it also is a catcher so if I put this in it'll stop things from going down the wrong side of my sink and then I can utilize this piece here which has a lock so if I turn it it won't stop the sink but if I turn it this way it does but I really wanted it for the mesh to grab anything that might come out and the sink drain was two dollars and nine cents Oh, this one is exciting. This is a stove guard. It was $2.49. And that's the kind of thing I'm loving. They have the most unusual items. So this is silicone. This little piece right here would touch my stove, right? So it will go this way on my counter. This goes up against the stove and this fills in that gap between my stove and my counter where things fall all the time. And it's made out of like a rubber or a silicone, but you can cut it if you need to, if it's too long. But I liked it that I feel like this material will stick to my the metal of my stove and not slide around. And it will stop the crummies from dropping because I'm forever pulling out my stove and having to sweep that because I cook on that side. Oh, this one is fun too. And I, I'm going to tell you why I like this one a lot. But this is a clean your mini blinds, right? So you slide it in between your mini blinds 
and you squeeze it and then you rub this back and forth and it cleans your blinds, right? Because they're a pain to dust. But this also slides off and can be washed, right? And then you just slide it right back on to these little fingers and you can use it on any size mini blind or really any place that you need to, to get into and dust. And this is a dollar 49 as well. And I liked it and I like that it has a hook here. I can just hang it somewhere, but I really like the fact that these slide off and they can be washed or wet. If you have a lot of a, like a dust issue, you can get in there and really clean those mini blinds, which I have big blinds in my dining room and I need to clean those. Okay, well, this is just adorable. This was, how much? $2.49. They are little condiment bottles for my lunch bag. Now, obviously they say ketchup and mustard, but you don't have to put ketchup and mustard in them. I'm dying, guys, I am dying. So uh, you just unscrew it. You can fill this up with whatever condiment that you need in your lunch that day. This is not on here very good. This sticker, I, you know, it'll peel right off. So I'm not worried about that. And then you just pull the lid keep dropping it you pull the lid off and you squeeze and you've got ketchup and mustard and then this screws on to keep it from leaking out are these not adorable and I pack my lunch all the time I will probably take these labels off just because like this one's already coming off but I don't need labels to know what's in there oh my god they're so cute or if you have a little that you pack lunch for, I'm sure they would appreciate it. Um, these are coffee spoons and they were $1.99 for the package. I'm sorry, I'm looking down, but I need to, I should probably put the prices like on a post-it note or something, but I just wanted you to know how much things were. So I got a pack of four and they are, I'm gonna pull them out. They're for my coffee bar because the plastic ones, I just, you know, I want to get rid of the plastic looking cheesy things. So I wanted to go with, I have a couple wooden ones that I really like and I may order some more of those, but these are, they're long spoons. They could also be used in like iced tea. I know in the South they have iced tea spoons to stir your sugar, but it goes It'll go deep into my coffee cup and then I'll be able to get down at the bottom or if I'm using a travel mug. And I thought they were so pretty. So you get a heart, like a flower, a different flower that almost looks know, like a daisy or something. I don't know. And then this one. So you get four different spoons. They're not overly heavy, but you don't really need them heavy to stir coffee. And so they would just go into my cup that I keep my coffee stirrers in and then in the morning when I make my coffee I like because I use cream I'll stir it and then at the end of the night I put that in the dishwasher so I thought that was super cute for $1.99 like the, the prices are good I don't know if you've ever ordered from like a wish app or Alibaba or anything like that I feel like the this is a very similar website oh this one I'm thrilled about this this is a garlic I think it was 79 cents, if I'm not mistaken. Let's see. Yeah, 79 cents. It's like a little mandolin, except for it's a cheese grater type thing. And what you do is you take the lid off, you put a whole clove of garlic in there. This presses it down. And now your, this thing here slides back and forth and you are grating your garlic. So you don't have to chop it up and deal with it. You just put it in here. Drop it in over your bowl, and this will take it all the way down to the nub. And I use a lot of fresh garlic, so I'm so excited. I know it's kind of cheesy, but I'm so excited. And then it's plastic and metal, so you just wash it up. The only thing I wish it would do, and maybe it does, and I just haven't figured it out, is I wish this would pop off. Uh, maybe, it, oh, I think I can take it off through, over the end. I think if I pop it, I can pop it off over that bump on the end. It has a little stopper here, so you don't, you know, pull it off easily, but just put that over your bowl. And now you can do garlic ginger. Would You could put a little piece of ginger down in here. Oh, 79 cents, that is a fantastic kitchen gadget. 
I don't have a whole ton of little stuff, but I wanted to get the little stuff out of the way. Um, is we're back into the kitchen with an egg slicer. I've always wanted one of these and I have never purchased it. So now I have. And the egg slicer is $1.99. And I eat a lot of hard boiled eggs. And this is just metal, but you put your egg here and this are um, just like metal wire. And then when your egg is hard boiled and you slide it over your egg slices and then you can either turn it the other direction and slice it or just take your knife and slice it and now you've got eggs for egg salad or for your salad at home or whatever and i just think it's so much easier to slice your eggs this way i love it so this is just the egg slicer and like i said there's a link below that'll take you to all these products that i purchased if there's anything you see that you want I picked up, this was in the Christmas section, which was interesting to me because it's not a Christmas, I mean, I guess it could be Christmas, but it's a ribbon, right? I'm trying to get it open nicely here, but I don't, okay, here we go. It's a ribbon, I'm gonna use it to decorate with, but they have little hearts. And so you have a string of hearts, a string of, that has the pearl, a red cord, and a gingham or I'm sorry, in a burlap, and you can wrap it around presents. You can hang it, like for Valentine's Day, you can wrap a present with this. I think that's what it's for, is gift wrapping. And yeah, this was, I don't know how many meters it was, but this was, um, $4.99 for the heart ribbon. How adorable is that? And I love it. I could save it for Christmas too. They did have some Christmassy stars and things, but I thought this would be fun for Valentine's Day if I gift something. Um, the next thing I grabbed, these are cord clips. I don't know if you're gonna be able to see what they are. I'm gonna take one out and show you. But what you do, and I'm excited because I need these for my, over my mantle, or on my mantle, because I have my TV hung. So you get some adhesive back here. There's stickers that go on, but you clip this to your wall or anything and you snap your cord. So one part goes in this side, one goes in this side and it holds your cords up against the wall. So they're not as obvious. And it does come with a sticker that you mount to whatever surface. I'll probably do it to my mantle and you stick it and then it holds your cords. And that I thought was fantastic. And it was $1.49 and you get 20 of these. So if you need to tidy up any like, I wouldn't say a bundle of cords, but it will hold one cord. And like in my situation, it's just the power cord to my TV. Oh, and then there is a, there is the adhesives are in here as well. And that they are, oh, they're 3M adhesives, which is nice. That's a good quality. So this will get used for that. And then I'll put this in my, you know, maintenance daily. I just have a couple more things in this bag. So while I'm doing that, let's move all this stuff back. This is so fun. I love getting these little gadgety things because I just enjoy them. But also I have some other stuff and I have another haul coming of household stuff. But this, these were some of the little, little dealies that I got. Um, I purchased these, which uh, 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 you guys are going to die when you see these. So these are caster wheels. And how much are they? $1.69 for a four pack. You also get stickers for these adhesives. You put it on the bottom of something that you want to wheel out. They are adhesive wheels. So you get four. So if you have like a tote or a pack something on a shelf and you want to be able to pull it in and out easily, it's a set of caster wheels and they go, I mean, they don't turn different directions. It's literally front and back. So you are kind of limited there, but they're adhesive. I'm dying. And you get four in a package for $1.69. I can't wait to figure out something to stick these to. I just thought they were fun and I wanted to see. And they also come with the adhesive. 
that you can use, but you can also just get double-sided sticker tape. Um, I would say nothing too heavy, I wouldn't imagine, or that getting too much lift, but definitely like something to go in your pantry. That would be super fun. And then I got some office supply stuff. So these are, uh, what are we calling these? I don't even know what they call these. Um, I'm trying to get it open while I look. These are paper, large paper clips that hold a pen. I know. Come on, girlfriend. All right, I'm getting scissors out for this one. Or in this case, my X-Acto knife. I'll get better at these hauls. I did try to open everything just to make life a little easier on us. And they had such fun planner supplies, which you know I'm obsessed with. I am obsessed with planner supplies. There we go. Okay, sorry about that. Goodness gracious. So you get, I think five, one, two, three, four, five. Yes, okay. So you put this on a notebook, right? And your pen. I'll show you. On my notebook. So if I am, um, got my notebook here. I'm gonna clip this just like, just like a paper clip would clip and then you can it holds a pen so you can put this on the front of a notebook or on the side and it holds like it holds that pen in there how fun is that these were super exciting i was really and i saw a couple different ones but i would say if you went this direction you just lift it and it holds a pen on top of your notebook, especially if you have like meetings and stuff and you get five of them. Oops, I lost one. So I have four of them and they are $1.49. Let me pick that up. $1.49 for a five pack and these are great. And I know they had them in different orientations as well, but I like this one for right now, I'm putting it away in my drawer. And then also on the office supply section, I grabbed this pen cutter. It is 99 cents. And on this end, you have an ink pen, which is a fine liner, writes perfectly well. This end is a blade. So you can do intricate cuts, like paper cutting. If you're doing face or um, scrapbooking or something like that, like you wanna be very careful. It's a pen point, but it's a razor. Like it cuts through paper. And I thought that was super handy to have around when I'm doing my crafting because I can mark it. And then if I need to cut, I can take a ruler and just run this along that line and get very clean cuts. And for 99 cents, I thought that was perfect. It goes in my drawer here. And then I got two more things which I think are adorable. This is a cat paw correction tape was $1.49, it came in pink. Some of these you can select colors and some you just get random. But it's correct for tape. And you know, we all know how that works. And it is a cat paw. Like what? And I already had one, some, I don't know if this is the same thing. This might be tape. Nope, they're both correction tape. So I got this one from Christmas for Sarah. And then I ordered this one. And these are two correction tapes, which I use when I do my planners. So this one I ordered. And like I said, this one was $1.49. And then wait till you get your eyes on these. So these are scissors. These are completely going into my craft bag that I take when I go and do my crafting. So they're safety scissors. So you pull them out. There's a little rubber tip. You don't have to leave that in there, but what and they're on a spring so they stay out and the spring reopens them so you can cut can you imagine just cutting threads or something with that and then if you don't want to put the rubber tip on it you don't need to oh i put it on backwards and then the scissors just go back in now i don't know i they're less than four inches they're less than three inches so these should be tsa approved and international air airline approved scissors that if you do crafting while traveling like knitting or sewing or anything this should work and it stays in its own little case and i'm assuming it's this is all the same branded stuff i just didn't get this i got this from shein and i got these from 
Timu. I know. So I put it in my drawer because that's where I keep all my little crafty bits. Okay, we got some bigger stuff now. So in here, this is so exciting for me. These are brushes, cleaning brushes that hook onto my drill that I just got. So you hook them on and when you they spin like your drill and clean. Can you imagine cleaning your shower tile with one of these? Getting in all the cracks and crevices and then look at this little one. Oh, I'm thinking for my car tires. This one is pretty soft. I'm thinking about taking it out and getting my, um, you know, the wheels on my car with that. And this whole set was $8.49. I, I love it. I'm super excited. This one is very firm. So I feel like this would be good for like toilet cleaning or kind of gross stuff. This one is medium. I don't know. I don't have a... a um, one of those showers that can scratch easy. I have tiles, so I know that'll be good. But they're just, they come with three different sizes for three different uses. But can you imagine getting a toilet clean with their drill and that? I can imagine and it's gonna happen. And then I'll just bleach it after. Okay, this is, I call it a Lazy Susan. I don't know what they call it. Is that offensive? I don't know. It was $8.99, but it is, you know, it has the spinners on the bottom so when it sits, it will turn. It says it's for like bathroom organization stuff and it may have end up under my bathroom sink with cleaning product or in my craft room, like on my craft table and hold stuff. But I thought that was pretty fantastic. Decent quality. It does make a lot of noise when it spins if that bothers you. I'm assuming it's just the wheels in the spinner in the table but yeah and it's a fair fairly decent size and like i said this was eight dollars and 99 cents and i don't know if it came in clear to be honest with you i would prefer white or clear i just try to do a lot of ooh, clear stuff so that if i buy things at different times from different places that was decent quality i will tell you if you're buying things on here for gifts sometimes the boxes are are kind of bent up and stuff when they arrive so just keep that in mind i'm gonna grab the last couple things okay there i got everything uh this was exciting this is an electric tea kettle cup it's a travel cup right it's a travel device i'm not going to call it a cup because i don't know that i would drink out of it i took it out and i already tried it and it does work i just wanted to make sure it would work okay so what you get is this here you open up the top your cord will be inside and some directions and things you plug it in here you fill it with water to the fill line right here so you get I can't remember how many ounces but like 16 ounces enough for a cup of tea you put the lid on and you open the spout so that it doesn't like blow up you open the spout I opened it and moved it to the side like it turns so your spout stays open so when you know it's it boils and then when you turn it on you hit this button and it will boil water it will boil water for you can you imagine traveling especially around here in the US where we don't get a lot of tea kettles in our rooms. There's coffee makers, but I don't like to heat my water in a microwave and I don't like to heat my water in a coffee maker for tea because I think it tastes like coffee. So this will just slide into my suitcase when I travel and I will always be able to make hot tea. And this one did come as a 110 volt, if that's important to you. And it has directions as well on the care and use of it. They had a couple other ones. This one specifically was $26.09, but they did have other ones um, that had like, you could control the temperature. They had many options for electric kettles, but I was looking for one specifically that would be easy for me to, hi Alex, for me to throw into my luggage when I, especially when I take car trips. Not necessarily when I fly, but when I take car trips. And it does come in white, and I think they had one in this mint color. Obviously, I got the white one. Okay, can you go please, sir? Thank you. 
Um, I am very excited about this. This is my electronic case. It's $6.99 and I even put something in it to show you how, what we'll do. But you even get a little card that tells you what to do. The inside is padded. These are Velcro, so you can change the orientation to fit whatever electronics you're storing. And then this holds your cords, cables, cords. You could put memory cards down here. Somebody had pens in it. Can hold all kinds of electronic things. This is a power bank. It's a battery bank from Anchor, and it's pretty large, and it fits right in here. You know, I could put that in here for travel or if I'm using it for long-term storage. I could put my bricks in here, any larger cables or more bricks over here and then cables up here. And then I can get rid of all the power cords I have that go to nothing. And then all of my electronics can be stored in one easy place. And I will know where all of my backup cords are and all of my travel. And it's nice quality, it's very padded. And like I said, it does come with directions and it comes with different colors. And if I didn't mention, it was only $6.99. I know, right? I thought that was fantastic. I'm excited. Um, I don't really remember ordering this, to be honest, but it came and this was $6.49. It's a candle. Um, so they do have wax on the outside, like that is wax. But when you turn it on, it has a fake little flame thing up here. This is just plastic that moves around and then it lights up. I thought it was cute. It was um, $6.49. So if you want the look of a candle, but you don't want um, the fire of a candle, these are great. Now they do have larger sets that are a little more, but they're um, battery, they're uh, controlled with the remote so you can turn them on and off, which I thought that's what I ordered, but I must not have, so. But yeah, these are great, especially at Christmas time. Like I could set this up in the middle of a wreath and that would be really cool. So this is uh, just an electric candle, $6.49. And the last thing I got was a professional digital scale. This is $8.99. Um, I use a scale a lot because when I cook keto, a lot of the ingredients are in grams and ounces and not in cups and teaspoons and things, which is actually a more accurate way to um, measure. But it does come with a plastic lid or cover to protect the scale. I don't have batteries in it right now, but it does do um, metric imperial cup. It does ounces, grams, pounds, all that. You have your power, you can tear the weight. So what that means is if I sit this on it, I can hit tear and it will zero it out and then I weigh my products. My other scale wasn't doing so great, so I needed a new one. And this is great because it'll hold a measuring cup and then I just drop in my ingredients and make it weighed. And there's some directions in here as well. It does take batteries. It doesn't come with the batteries. And it also comes with another big case. So I don't, I'm not sure which I'm assuming these are storage vessels for this. Yeah, so this one goes over the whole device to protect it. So you could just do that, or I have just this little slip cover, but I could leave that on it. it. Just protects it when it's in your cabinet. So yeah, that was everything I received this time from Timu, T-E-M-U. Check down below in the description box, and there is a link to all the items I have today. I hope you enjoy and have a good one. Bye.